Hello everybody and welcome back to CK2. We left off last episode furious that we're not allowed to murder the Carpathians is uh, with Chinese. I'm also married to uh, a Chinese prince. Um, oh shoot, I've got gout. I've got gout. Well, that's not ideal. Um, uh, let's try something new, I insist. I really don't think we should because there's like, at least it seems like there's a high chance of screwing it up. Okay, he came to my chambers and offered you a drought which was yellow in color. He told you to pinch your nose and you drank it. When the tepid liquid passed your lips, you almost immediately spat it out again. You meant to know what the content was, and he revealed it was fresh urine from a pregnant sow, which seems to have done the trick. Um, something else we are doing right now, too. Um, this, this girl right here is the Queen of Italy and in my prison. So we're trying to convert her to... Uh, well, I put her, her on um, Heritage Focus, and I'm her guardian, so hopefully we'll convert her. And then we'll have a Hellenic queen in charge of Italy, which could potentially work to my benefit, but who knows. Carpathia might just continue steamrolling the planet. Kinswoman, 12 years old. Let's go over here. At least the family tree is starting to grow a little. It was getting a little narrow, but that was my own fault. Hey, wanted to see. Wow, you are in a few wars. All of them defensive. Holy crap, you've only got 7,000 troops to your name? You have no troops. He's got nobody. Oh, well, that's a shame. Sucks to be you, friendo. Ooh, castle walls. Fort level plus one. Yes. Any place that could have... A, I think we've already done that in several. Corinth, 6.5, yeah. So we've already done that. We do more stables. Might as well. Keep increasing our troop levels. I've arrived in the private room of Duchess Viviana. There's plenty of food and drink here, and the mood is uh, decidedly merry. I'm look for looking forward to this. Well, she likes me, so low chance of getting murdered. Brought out the board game in pieces. It's just we play a few rounds to determine who's the better strategists. <laughs> she insists we play for money. We play for hours, the tides of fortune ebbing and flowing as I tried to attack my opponent's position without opening my defenses too much. Eventually, I found a critical opening, made a few inspired and aggressive moves, and won the game. Wait, she insisted I we play for money and I didn't win any money? Who's this? This is my son. Uh, well, steward education seems pretty good for you. So go ahead and, and keep that flowing. Pitiful state of my daughter, Alexia. Well, she's got the blood, so we definitely don't want her to die. We want to keep uh, family members alive and family members with the blood especially alive. The reveling and carousing is over for now. Time to get back to real life. It was fun or I decided all my... Uh, I dedicate all my free times to games now and I gained the Game Master trait. Yeah, do it. Game Master is a good trait. Look at all those temporary modifiers. Serious illness. Yeah, gout will do that. Personal combat minus 40 right now. From gout and from serious illness. I'm on family focus. I can change that to hunting. Let's do that. Let's change it to hunting focus. Time outside, uh, getting some good exercise, fresh air. Might do good against the gout. Discovered a man of great military talent. Well, he's called the Dragon. He's a Kinslayer. He's a very uh, good Greek. Um, yeah, sure. Join, friend. So how old is this kid? She's 12. Okay. So we got a couple. We got four years. She's got a pet rat. Should I maybe put it, maybe we do house arrest? Get her, oh, she lost her pet rat. <laughs> look at, look at, look at this though. Slow hair lip. 
she's not going to be a great, uh, well, slow, slow is a pretty bad trait no matter what. Yeah, I'm I'm fine with being one over my my limit there. All right, how's my plot? 140 percent, nothing happening. I've killed so many of these bastards. This is a uh, this is infuriating though. 32 more years of peace. Pe peasants in Achaea spent a long time on the road in order to meet with the augurs, or so your serious claims suggest that it would be in their interest to construct local shrines. I always do, whenever they say that, I always say yes, prosperity be good. I wonder, I don't have the blood of Phyllis. And I do have a, a fair few prestige. I wonder if I'd be able to form a bloodline as... Sibla, Sibilia, Sibilia. Uh, Sibilia. Uh, as I retired to my chamber, I was shocked to find a copy of the dramatic Sages on my bed. Well, I'm going to read it for the piety. I think maybe 10,000 would do the trick. Let's take the piety and move on. Ooh, that's a fair few troops. Seven, exactly 7,000 from vassals. Can I increase the size of my retinue yet? Nope. Nope, Still, still nothing. I was looking off screen and I was thinking that doing a Ethiopian Jewish run might be fun because there's a lot more before you're just kind of you're right in over here I think where you start and um, not much to do other than just kind of hope the Abbasids don't come for you but now there's a lot more African stuff to work with so that could be a lot of fun. So they have an interesting retinue. It's like 500 light infantry or something like that. So you can get really large amounts of of troops, but not necessarily that great. What's this one? Cataphrag training ground. Go ahead and get the base level there too. How's this one? Get yeah, excellent. Hard to feel proud when there's nothing to be proud of. Well, I mean, I feel like you do. Apostate has been found. Who is this? Aw. Well, what's, what's with the head wound? What happened to you? <sighs> Highly suspicious. Ah, uh, yeah. He might be. He might have been evil. He might have been in um, Bacchus's own or whatever it was. You know, the 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 Hellenic Lucifer's own. Do I have warrior training yet? Not already uh, gained a commander trait from... Okay, no, I don't. We should go ahead and do that. Oh, nice. Oh, my dot. Wait. Jupiter would be proud of you. Pontifex Maximus... Uh, Maximus? Pontifex Maxima uh, Athanasia tells me, softly humming the tune I just finished singing before clearing her throat. It's just something I made up while we were marching, I say dismissively. You should keep it up, friend, the woman argues. It's good for morale for the troops, you know. Well, that's a nice one right there. Movement speed, morale damage, morale defense. I mean, she would not be... a bad military commander. She's got some good traits. So I've got I've got two like Greek helmets now. Your husband sent me a gift. It is a puppers. I will take the gift because I love tricky puppies. Oh, you're ugly. Should smother you with a pillow. Um Hey Ugo, why don't you go uh Here, go etiquette. Um just 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 give the ugly kid something to do. Maybe he'll get his face cut off, and it won't matter at some point. Little jerk uh, has not died. It just keeps going up. He never, they never get weaker. <laughs> it's awful. After all those murders, well, who's this? War chiefs, oh, it's the Yams Vikings. It's all the Holy Order. I was, I was like, what is that black splooch up there? What would that be, like Estonia? 
It's just the albums of Vikings. I really would like to get the the Pontifex. So it, right now we're actually in a good position. Um, if I died, I would become um, Athanasia here. All right, so I need a new thingy, right? Oh, here we go. Ooh, ooh, ooh. So I was right. I can do it because I do not have the blood of Phyllis in here. Let's see, in order to complete this ambition, you need to perform one of the following tasks or be found uh, to found a bloodline your own, murder or execute 30 people, win 15 foreign wars, rule at peace for 30 years, build 10 cities, 10 castles, or 10 temples. I mean, murder slash execute would be easy. Might, might as well. She's still rel relatively young. I could just switch this over to War Focus at some point. Oh, am I composing a book? Oh, yeah, 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 because I have a high diplomacy, right? Yeah. Yeah, because I remember now, because I said it was like, maybe I'll do diplomacy or my shittiest stat. Having invested myself in this literary endeavor, I have been feeling drained lately. When my scribes ask me what the next section of the book should be about, I throw my hands in the air. How should I know? You cannot rush these things. I need inspiration. For, let's see, perhaps I'll indulge in some late night festivities with the soldiers. 43% chance to get wounded, 5% chance to get maimed. Has a chance of raising the quality. For some sort of draw, gains vomiting, 1% chance I die. Let's, uh, let's go, let's do this one. Let's go play, let's, let's go have fun with the soldiers. I, if I, the only way I'll die is if I roll a nat 1 on a d20, so... Ooh, my puppy's grown up. Castle walls have been built in Tusculum, which is something I've been interested in because when raiders come, I think if it's above level wall level six, it, it is they can't they can't assault it down. They have to actually siege it. But getting the troop levels up here will uh, help in that it'll make the sieges take longer. Or if I get enough troops in there, they just won't be able to complete them to begin with. So keep. Keep it up. That one's building. Kind of want to keep a lot of money in the bank these days. Oh, it doesn't look like anything happened. Oh, I still have gout, though. Murder X. Oh, it tells you exactly how you're doing. So we're already to 9 of 30. So hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Upset the Lords of Carpathia. Those were horrific. Yeah, there we go. That worked. Um... So, did I hear, did, did I feed one of those girls to a bear, by any chance? Because I heard... Uh, mauled to death by a bear, yeah, I heard, I heard a bear, I heard bear noises. Uh, in there, and, uh, yeah, bear. Interesting way to execute someone. Dedicated temple. Yeah. Um... Do a, uh, another, another Vestal temple. I've gotten to the point where I'm just randomly picking those. Um, what? My husband's been avoiding me. I, why do I have this event twice? He's not visited my bedchamber in several weeks. When I demand to know why he has given me nothing but feeble excuses. Today I overheard a couple of the servants gossiping. Said he's contracted syphilis. Which he has. Oh my. Um I am sorry, but I cannot risk that. I don't know why that that hit twice, but he's definitely you su well, at least he 
he produced we produced a couple decent errors these three I think or ours I can't ri I, I like this character I like how things are going right now I can't risk getting the sif because you can't keep it in your pants she's been in prison her entire life almost intrigue focus I don't I very specifically remember putting her on something else and I don't think I can force her <laughs> mauled to death by a bear oh did my husband just die Where did your eye go? Oh, how old am I? 39. Well, chan chances are I'm not going to be producing any children. I believe in this game at 40, your your uh, f your your female fertility goes way down. And I do um do apologize for what happened. It's rather unfortunate. Is it 5,000 for an invasion? 5,000. Oh. Recently sent a eunuch. Oh, I, wait. Oh, she's only worth 290? Oh, there's actually a breakdown of what she's worth and why. Interesting. But anywho, I need a man in my life. My son here is only seven. Well, I mean, it doesn't really matter. Uh, whoever we pick, I mean, you know, I kind of just want someone with a decent stewardship right now. Cause oh, it's you. Yeah, why not? I mean, these guys, he doesn't have, I'm pretty sure that one doesn't even have the blood, so it doesn't matter. But we're trying to, we're trying to do ourselves a murder, a murder line. And ideally, what we could do is maybe we get a, bur a murder line. A My Righteous Lords are gone for the stroller left behind and heartbroken. Oh, I'll just visit his grave. He cheated on me, then died in a dungeon of syphilis. Thanks to Jupiter's great mercy, there was no other visitors at, uh, Kigshi's grave when I arrived. I spent sir I should know his name at least post-mortem. Spent several hours mere yards from his cold body contemplating the fragility of life and love when I returned to my chambers as if by a sign uh sent from Kigshi, I found his lucky charm on the floor. A lover's memento, which gives me more health. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna throw that out. And I can go without a husband for two years. It's not the end of the world. Yeah, so this is, this kid does not have uh, the blood. I don't have the blood. My designated heir does, but chances are... I kind of just grabbed the first person on the list that had the highest stewardship. And that, that just happened to be him, so mm, that's fine by me. Commander has improved significantly. It's an organizer now. Wow, I got the castle infrastructure up to level six. Well, oh, you know why? I've been dumping it directly into that because it gives you increased castle tax. My co-conspirator King Herman has procured a poisonous viper. Finally, let's do this. I don't think I don't think chain assassinating these bastards is gonna work, unfortunately. Oh wait, well, well I mean uh, he he is dead. Let's see. Slipped away into the night, and the guards are now too busy contending with a string of lethal snake attacks to search for those responsible. All right, next. All, everybody always wants the Emperor of Carpathia dead. This will fill up with kings, I think, without too much uh, issue. 
I wonder if I ever burn people alive. Yeah, definitely. That definitely sounds like burned alive. I, I wonder if I ever do that just for no reason. If like someone just some dick just spread a rumor about him, and I was like, yeah, let's burn him. So these people seem to uh, like this current one, unfortunately. Money continues to flow through flow through the trade port in Corinth. Well, who owns it? Yup. Mob it down. Mob it up. Mob it up. Skillfully use diplomacy to make the mob back down. Uh, Alright, so this is the newest barony. So now I think we just uh, keep going down the line and building everything we need to here. Getting those troop levels up. I don't want to get rid of my gout. Be great to get rid of my gout. Because that would get rid of serious illness, too. So I've got health minus three right now. Oh, that's that's a that, that's a bit of a dick move. It stacks, so I've got gout, health minus two, and then yeah, I've got gout, health minus one. Uh, as she's growing older, I can see that Theodora could use some guidance in some of my experienced areas. Um. Well... They become bitter rivals. She's I, I don't know. I'm like I'm not wasting anything on my on, from from me for this little shit. No siree. Ah, <sighs> they they seem to be permanently broke these days. Uh, jerks. I'm gonna run you down with my heavy freaking cavalry. I don't know whose that is that's fighting you right now. Oh, hi. Hopefully I'll get there in time to help out. I did not. I mean, I murdered those guys pretty good. Oh, they're already heading there. Shoot. Shoot. <laughs> well, they're doing pretty good. Except for on the flank. Oh no, someone else came to help me. I was like, why am I doing so good all of a sudden? Victory! Fedor was captured in battle. Well, he'll make a suitable sacrifice to good old Jupes. <laughs> Orthodox Uprising. Feel like uh, Germanic has taken over the world. Even Sunni, while they've got that huge nation, it's kind of split between Sunni and Yazid uh, Yazidi. And Catholicism is is almost all Cathar. This is the first game of CK2, you know, that wasn't weird, where I didn't do something crazy with mods or settings, where Catholicism just died. Like, look at, look at this. This is nuts. There's so much shit on the list you can't even see. It's not even usable. You can't even see what's on there. Might as well do my light infantry. Make them a little more useful. Uh, what was I gonna look for in here? Oh, I was gonna look at to see if anybody else has joined the, the plot. Well, a couple, yeah. Sort by plot power. He probably will want a fair few dollars. Yeah, fair few ducats. Empress of Carpathia. They've kind of like civilized. Except for the fact that they're still raiding bastards. I don't know why, but the uh, game's really laggy today. Maybe I'll do a rest Maybe I'll restart my computer after this just to see if that helps clean it up. Seems like the autosaves are taking a while and. Like when I go to pan and stuff, it's just start. It gets uh, it gets weird. It gets it gets kind of chunky. Chunk. I want I want to say chunky, chuggy, kind of chugs along. Where is this temple of Saint Germans? I'm not going. I am not sailing to Cornwall. 
Uh, it looks like our 10 years are up. There's, there's nobody in the world that can stand against them. They're far too strong. And look, they're e even in, like, well, this area got smashed pretty good. So I was going to say, even in the, like, strong Sunni areas, got smashed by the Catholics and the, and the Orthodox, and those both collapsed to the German Germanics. I always want to see Germans. Germanics. And the Raiders have returned. They can't do a lot of da- We've got pretty good castles these days. It's not like they can do a lot of damage. It's really just more of an annoyance. Heavy cavalry versus their light infantry is just a, a disaster for them. Oh, yeah. And you yeah, keep sending people to jupes. I don't know if those count for me. Because I wasn't personally there. 13, so I don't think so. Or at 92% without trying. No, we could do. When do we have to wait till 57? Two more years. A queen to remember. While avoiding being forgotten entirely is my primary concern, it is also equally important for me to think about how I actually do wish um, posterity to think of me. How can I make sure that when I die, future generations will speak in awe and wonder about my accomplishments as queen and feel inspired to emulate me? I'll become a paragon of virtue. I will bring prosperity and knowledge to the realm. They will remember fear. Forge your bloodline through ordinary means. I, I don't know. I don't, I've never seen this before, so I don't know where these these lead to. Um, I, I'm leaning towards one or two. I'm going to say Paragon of Virtue. I've already got, like, good piety and good prestige. They still have enough men to get through the walls, unfortunately. Yeah, by a lot. Small gathering of friends. Sure. Hospital in Rome has seen an increase in the amount of people looking for food and shelter lately. Can barely provide the food required as is. Perhaps this would be a good opportunity to make an impression. Oh, my. Um, sure. I mean, I have the cash on hand. Alms and other supplies have been brought to the hospital. It will make life much easier for those in need. The question is how to represent this extraordinary gift. This is a gift from their queen. Jupes made it possible. The realm provided this offering. I'm doing it for the people. Um, didn't I lose Proud before? I think I'd like to have Proud back. But, but I did not get it. I'm wondering if uh, doing the Forge Bloodline thing, there's like a series of events, or you could do it through these means. Complete the ambition you need to perform one of the following tasks, uh, or to found a bloodline through other, or do it through other means. Okay, yeah. So yeah, I think there's probably like an event chain. Should, do, do we want to just throw these guys like at the enemy, see what happens, see how well they do? Oh, their morale is like awful. Uh, so, oh god. I don't know where 10,000 other troops came from, but yeah, they, you know, we got them. I wonder if that one counts towards my my murder total. My murder tally. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, where am I going? Back. Uh, Here. No, it did not. But I think with that, we're going to leave this right here. Thanks for watching, everybody. I do appreciate it. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you've been enjoying this series of Seek Cake 2, and I will see you all next time.